As a high-ranking spy and a white glove for the Chinese Communist Party, Sean is publicly known as the chairman and CEO of Pacific Alliance Group, one of the largest privity investment companies in Asia, which manages over $40 billion funds. Sean was a senior partner of Texas Pacific Investment Group while acting as TPG's consultant also till today. In fact, after the CCP joined the WTO, they utilized spies like Sean to infiltrate the U.S. for stealing technological achievements, deceiving the American people for their investments to give blood to the CCP. We can use pension funds as an example. In December 2021, San Francisco City and County Employees Retirement System Board report showed that in 2018, the Spurs invested 50 million U.S. dollars to PAG. Again in 2019, the Spurs invested 100 million dollars to PAG. And in 2020 Spurs continued to invest $25 million to PAG. In addition to getting the Spurs' fund, they've also reached their black hands on the Los Angeles Pension Fund. Lacers invested $100 million to the TPG in 2018, and it is a longtime partner with TPG back to 1999. Lacers has invested $152.5 million to TPG over the years. The PAG and TPG also obtained funds from Texas Permanent School Funds. According to September 2018 Texas Permanent School Fund report, TPG was granted $75 million and PAG received $100 million. All these are just the tip of the iceberg. These Americans' pension funds were growing on paper with the CCP's bubble economy. So, American people's pension funds will disappear along with the collapse of the CCP's bubble economy. Sean Weijian's companies are undoubtedly blood-sucking tubes that insert into the Americans. The American people should beware Sean's companies in his true color as a Communist Party spy and a thief-stealing pension funds.